guys, it's Daryl, and today I'm going to give you guys a quick tip for the new Divi Theme 3.0, and I'm going to talk to you guys today about how to optimize the text module for mobile users. Now, as of 2014, there are more mobile users than there are desktop users, so optimizing your site for mobile is pretty important now, not unless you're those crazy people at Starbucks that just kind of sit on their laptops all day and steal all those packets of sugar, but uh, most of us, you know, we check our phones when we're at work or at our friend's house, etc. So let me give you an example of what I'm talking about. So I'm gonna scroll down on my website right here. And I'm sure you guys have seen this, you know, like on your website where you have titles like this. So right here we have our recent work is amazing, we know. I wanna show you now how it looks on the mobile device. Okay, so I'm scrolling down. And it looks like that, it looks like crap. It's all cluttered, it doesn't look good. So I'm gonna show you today how to fix this. So first I'm gonna go back to my desktop view and we're gonna to go to that module. All right, and remember, you should be doing this on every header text that you have that introduces like a new section. So this right here introduces this section, and uh, you know this introduces this section. So I'll show you how to optimize it for the mobile and the tablet today. So the first thing we wanna do is go over here and click on the gear icon. And you wanna find your text. My text is white, so you can't see it. So I know it's right there. But uh, you wanna actually change this right here to the heading one. And you can actually design this. So going to your design, now it's the header font and the header text instead of the uh, the text font, etc. So for example, I can go over here and change the size. So now this part is controlling the header text. So I'm just gonna leave it blank for now. I'm just gonna leave it standard. Click on the checkbox. And now I'm going to see how it looks on the mobile device. All right, there you go. So it's fully optimized for the phone. Now let's check the tablet. There you go, so now it looks good on the tablet device. And it's really important to do this for all the sections that you have that introduce uh, you know, a, a new section because uh, somebody asked me, they're saying it looks all clumped together and I told them you're not using the correct module. But um, that's all I wanted to show you guys today, but I will be having uh, more tutorials coming out such as an e-commerce Divi tutorial, but not until they kind of fix up bugs and stuff like that. There are some things that are a little bit wrong. Also, I will be selling these uh, Divi layouts. That's right, I am creating uh, probably four websites, uh, you know, like pre-made websites that you just import and export to your website. It's pretty simple. So I'll be selling those uh, later on. So be sure to like and subscribe and check that out. Other than that, if you guys have any other questions regarding Divi or anything you want to tell me, feel free to put it in the comment section and I will do my best to get back to you. So I'll see you guys all later.